We had a chance to talk one on one with Dr. Mehmet Oz ahead of the rally here in Westmoreland County. He told me watching the COVID-19 pandemic unfold is ultimately what pushed him to seek public office. During COVID, I witnessed this remarkable government overreach, this authoritarianism, one size fits all approach that was very harmful for us. And I've always felt individualism was the best path forward, empower people. Dr. Mehmet Oz says his experience as a heart surgeon and as a national television host has prepared him for the challenges he may face in Washington. Oz telling me he wants to have an open mind, talking with people on both sides of the aisle. When it comes to Western Pennsylvania, he says one of his priorities would be allowing this region to tap into more natural resources in the years ahead. The Southwest Pennsylvania is the hub of energy in the state, and there is no excuse for our energy not being harvested out of the ground. Our natural gas here would power the whole country for hundreds of years. Oz telling a crowd of supporters in Mount Lebanon he still believes the 2020 election needs to be investigated for potential fraud. And as the debate over Roe versus Wade and abortion intensifies, Oz says he always has been pro-life. But unlike some Republican counterparts, he believes there is room for exceptions in situations like incest and rape, and also when the mother's life is in danger. So I'm talking about she will die if this child is carried. I can find it in my heart to understand that exception, and I'm not alone. I do believe that's where most conservative Republicans land on this issue. And now Dr. Ross says obviously receiving that endorsement from former President Donald Trump was a big boost for him, something he hopes to build on, especially after the rally here at the Westmoreland Fairgrounds. Reporting in Mount Pleasant, Jim Madalinski, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.